Hagerstown, Maryland, where we find our Stephen Cohen, who has been following Republican candidate Neil Parrott's campaign. And Stephen and Parrott is looking to flip this seat that was uh, held by Rep uh, Representative David Troner, Democrat. And how is he feeling at this point? I see you're joined with him. Here in Hagerstown, we're with Neil Parrott. Uh, he's looking at a new, fresh set of numbers that shows he's going to pull ahead of April McLean Delaney in this race. What do you see in the numbers tonight? Well, the numbers are what we expected so far. We're right in a position where we need to be to win this race. It looks like it's going to be very close. Uh, the early numbers that came in show us behind, but that's a lot of vote by mail. And a lot of Republican voters don't tend to vote by mail. We're encouraged to be able to bank their vote, get in early, vote by mail, but that's just not happening yet. Um, so we expect to be behind, but now that Election Day voting is coming in, we've taken the lead, and I uh, hope the lead just continues to go the rest of the evening. Um, there's still more vote-by-mail ballots, though, so we're going to have to have a margin to make sure that we have victory at the end of the day. So there's a good chance we don't know who wins this race tonight. Well, it is early. Should the lead hold up, you would be taking the oath of office in January. Just any thoughts about the challenges and responsibilities of well, I just take this very seriously. Uh, my goal is going to be represent all five counties. I'd be the first person who actually lives in this district since 2012 to win. Um, you know, we need somebody who lives here that can actually help the folks here. And that would be my job. I would work on that very diligently. All the counties, all the municipalities, I'd make sure to represent every single person, whether they voted for me or not, I'm going to be with them. Thanks. Neil, thank you so much. Back to you in the studio. All right. Stephen Cohen there with 